And we're back. Dark and Ran in Mass Effect 3. Hello. Last time we... At least in terms of main mission stuff, we went down and got uh, Morden and Eve, and now we've done side mission stuff like finding Rachni. Again. Yay. And, you know, stopping Cerberus up to no good. Now we've got still a few things left to do. So let's take a look see around. Actually, we do need to stop at the uh, Citadel. Because hmm. I don't know if you remember, while we were down there investigating the Rachni, to dock, Normandy. we you found a um, last report. message from one of the Krogan scouts that was killed. Oh, yeah. He wanted to deliver to an Asari on the Citadel. This way. Not you. You over here. Excuse me. I'm sorry. You need to hear this. Oh, Rose of Helium. If these humble words reach you, then I have joined my ancestors. No, no, no. My dream was to be by your side, a weed beside your beauty, twining together in the warm Tachanka sun. Oh, Char. But if my last days must be with Krant instead of Karnas, still I will remember the perfume of your scent. And the the poet was something. Huh? It was the poet, wasn't it? You remember? Let I remember the poet, yes. <laughs> yep. Around your garden, so you and the flower we planted together can grow safe and strong. Thank you. Uh, I should... I need to go. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, that's... Uh, a little painful. Yeah. Shepherd VI. <laughs> <laughs> oh, of course. The 7% accurate personality matrix. Uh, none of these are really useful to me. We've already bought everything from them. Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. Ooh, open it. Mm -hmm. the best in the Come to Casa. Hmm. Oh my. All goods have What's the difference between this eviscerator and the standard one, though? Oh. Let's do that. This model removes all Cerberus branding. I guess if you feel like spending your credits on it. But I think we've already got a Raptor, so no point. Yeah, that one. Liara and her dad still talking over there. So I see. Is there anything else on the Citadel? I don't think so. Can't do that yet. Don't want to do that yet. Can't you do that or that yet. Where do I get that? Oh, I don't get that till a while later. Uh, Garrus is still down there in the hold. No one knew, no one knew, no one knew, no one knew. So no, there's nothing left here. Right. I think... In terms of side mission stuff, we have some stuff on Tachanka. And then after that, it's just straight... Uh, scanning side missions. Time to do more side missions. 
Let's get the scanning stuff out of the way since everything else would be on Tachunka. I don't know. If I remember where they all are. Minor details. So that's for later. What's over mm. here? STG base under attack. Let's go there. Oh my. Ilos. That was mm -hmm. the last planet in the first game. Mm-hmm. I found something. doesn't make any more sense. Nope. You think they, like the Bioware just said, here, take some acid and make a scene with it. Surely, like, we're even supposed to have some kind of translation in our heads and it doesn't seem to have any difference. Pretty much. Yeah, it's like, Report to Spectre Command, Ilos STG facility. Normandy SR2 science officer on behalf of Spectre Shepard. We entered the STG base, finding no survivors of the research team. Salarian bodies had been left to decompose with clear signs of torture on several victims. We saw evidence of Cerberus responsibility given fire patterns correlating to Matic rifles and human blood. Cerberus has removed the old protein systems containing the Vigil VI and hacked the main research database. Data recovered from an audio surveillance suggests they interrogated the staff about the catalyst before killing them. Hmm. Commander Shepard sent something, investigating a cor investigated a corridor, finding a hidden door that responded to the cipher. Inside was an intact beacon along with a functioning stasis chamber containing strange, semi-organic looking implants. We believe the beacon broadcast the original warning signal from Milos. The commander touched it and suffered a paralyzing vision. He was immediately evacuated to Normandy Med Bay and is now recovered. The commander believes the vision showed the implants being used. In addition, a map showing other locations of possible protein sites. Normandy team will continue to investigate these vaults to see whether they can give us clues to the catalyst. Cool. Okay then. Where the fuck? I guess that's part. Of, I guess that's part of the mod. Something like that. Part of a mod, yeah. Yeah, I mean, they might not be able to make custom missions for us, but. At least they got they got good writing. I swear one of them does add custom missions. Hmm. But, uh, maybe they're later game. I don't know. Maybe. Actually, a lot of this is all new territory for me. Signal confirmed. So let's investigate, shall we? Yep. And the dogs are barking outside because of course they are. I don't hear anything. That's good, that probably means that the recording doesn't either. Of course not, if I don't hear it, no one else will. Mm hmm. Hmm. Weird. There's other things that up. Hmm. Emphasis on was. Oh, subsequent sites cannot be v visited until the team has completed its work. So we basically just have to wait until... Yeah, go do something else. But we did yeah. get some new intel, so let's go investigate it. Ooh, intel. Solarians can function with just one hour of sleep. Man, I wish I could. Right. I can function on about three and a couple cups cups of solid caffeine. Have we found <laughs> any new engineers for the Crucible, Glyph? Five Exonax Industries scientists who attempted to reverse engineer Prothean technology stolen Planet Garvak. They are technically still wanted by the Council for hiding Prothean technology. As well, Sonax is part in instigating an illegal war on Garvak. I'm sure the Council will forgive that for helping with the Crucible. 
Extend those scientists amnesty and an invitation right away. I like how just walking just in here gives us an extra a asset. Right. Really pays off to check on your crew. Mm-hmm. Hmm. There was intel in mm. here. I guess it was just the asset or something. And then maybe it just needs to be researched. Well, maybe. Leaked vidcoms from Omega. A message from your dedicated Talon fighters live from Omega. Servers may have taken over Omega, but that doesn't mean they've won. This is our territory, our home, and we won't stand idly by while Servers turns this place into a prison. Stand strong, Omega. The towns have not abandoned you. We, will, we shall not rest until Servers is out of Omega and your homes are returned to you. Funny. <coughs> More research from Dr. Ava Corre. You know, the person that used to be Edie's body. Um... Cliff found a match between Ava Corre and Cerberus. <clears throat> the original, unpublished Cerberus Manifesto was broadcast throughout Arcturus Station in 2157. During the transmission, the elusive man mentions the death of two humans, Ben Hishlop and Ava Corre, who I'm unable to find any information about. There's absolutely nothing in the broker network that references these two, which means that someone went through an extraordinary amount of effort to erase all traits of them. The only reference I can find is an in a redacted Turian's intelligence report called the Arca Monolith Incident. I'll see if we can get anything out of the Primarch, but considering how critically important he is to ensuring a Krogan-Turian alliance, it's too risky to push any further. In the meantime, I'll keep Glyph on the case. <clears throat> now let's see... Salo. A lot. Oh boy. I'm just scanning through it. Oh, this is more stuff about the, uh. Supposed. I think this is supposed. Uh. Virtual aliens, I think. Huh. Well, it is quite a lot. Yeah, this is about the, uh. Sh the, go quote, ghost ship that's actually full of virtual. Uh. Digital aliens. Hmm. That's a whole lot of lore that can be read on your own time and probably found in else yep. other places. Protheon yeah, notes. Any, any viewers are free to post a video. Yeah, I'd have to scroll a lot slower for it to actually be legible, but anyway. <laughs> Protheon notes. Entry 3. If what Javik says is true, his people were imperialists who left the rest of the galaxy quaking in terror. And I think he would sacrifice all of us without a thought if it could bring them all back again. I reviewed my old notes today. They're so childish. Do we romanticize the Protheans because we were dazzled by the technology they left behind? Are these really the people I dedicated my life to studying? Kind of. <clears throat> yeah, basically. An email from a Dr. Locke to Admiral Hackett. Security almost opened fire on the Rachni when their ships pulled up to the Crucible, Admiral. I had to invoke your name more than once before they were let on board. They're following instructions, but my god, do I have to tell you how nervous everyone is on the project see Rat and I strutting down the halls. They almost gave Professor, Professor Lau a fit. I'll let you know how the next staff meeting goes. So they, they didn't just get ready to help in, in time, they just went right into the crossable construction site to help. Yep. I mean... Bugs would probably know a thing or two about building big things. Yeah. It just <laughs> amuses me. Meanwhile, in audio log, Grunt addressing new Arlac Company recruits. Oh, boy. <clears throat> Still don't understand why they put a tank-grown freak in charge of a whole company. <laughs> and I don't understand why they gave me whining piejacks for soldiers. I've got more years on the battlefield than you have kills, Runt. Trying to mate with Solarian females doesn't count as fighting. No one talks to her. Someone help him up. We move in an hour. I love Grunt. Yep. <laughs> Trying to mate with Solarian females doesn't count as fighting. <laughs> I believe that is what they call a burn. Hey, yep. Well, they are Krogan, alright. Yep, Krogan are Krogan. 
I think we've already gone around to talk to that pretty much everyone else right now. Yeah, I think so. Now at least. So in the meanwhile... Uh, I suppose it's time to go to the Chanka? No, I'm trying to remember where Rune is. And I can't remember where it is. I don't know the Mass Effect Galaxy that well. I have no idea where that is. Uh, you can at least tell me what sector it's in. Come on, game. Hmm. <sighs> Let's see. If I make guesses based off of just politi uh, the political terrain, it'd have to be in this region because the Volus, which Irune is their homeworld, are a client race of the Turians, which are in this region. Hilarious that Tachunka is right in between. Hilarious that Tachunka is literally right here next to the Citadel. Yeah, that is kind of funny. There's a thing! I found Pinky! Cartagena Station. Oh my. Louded, but. Okay, we got something new. Lauded by the Systems Alliance as the only beacon of civilization in the Abyss, it turns out the reality is quite different. <clears throat> Pirates, mercenaries, and infamous corporations have made this station their home, all under the ineffective watch of the local security force Cartagena Patrol. All that lends credibility to the station is the fact that CPAT allows the Alliance to dock for refuel and repair. Without that, Cartagena Station would just be another hive of scum and villainy in the Nimian Abyss. Advisory service recommends all visitors to wear personal combat armor at all times. Sounds like a well, sounds like a great place to go for vacation. Right? Only we can't actually go there. Huh? Refugee flotilla. That's a few. That last line is actually pretty interesting. In the midst of these ships are a score of Batarian corvettes, which are acting as an escort across unsafe space. We need antibatarians. Uh, <laughs> you know shit's bad. Yeah. I mean, they got hit first, so that's probably relevant. Yep. I did not mean to hit that button. It's, de it's, it's definitely not going to be in this cluster if the Alliance has a foothold here. Yeah. I've been here already. Maybe out here. Watch me be mm. completely Maybe. wrong. It's on the other side of the galaxy. It probably is now I think about it, because I'm I'm searching fucking terminus space and all these far out areas. But I should just about face, go back to civilized space. Like Man. just you can see the the lines dividing uh territory. Yeah. I need to be in Citadel space, not in uh the abyss. Or Determinus. It's mm. KG. That's... Oh, there was... That's the Hanar homeworld. No, not Han Hanar. Maybe... Fuck! I don't know worlds. Yeah, Hanar. Mm. What do we got here? Drell wet work teams. Welcome. Nice. Anything else? Do we have fuel? We have fuel. Cool. Fuel is important. This is Systems Alliance space. Hmm. 
So it's going to be in Turian or Asari space, if I was to guess. Nope, there's a rune. It's even labeled. Yay! I found something. Staying in the sky, I guess. Yep. Alright, what do we find? The Book of Plenix. It's basically part of the foundations of Volus culture. Mm. Which you might think is a bit questionable considering they're the capitalist faction race. But, <coughs> if you look, um, I've just heard it so many times I remember it. Uh, when you, uh, when you overhear him talking about they need it to remind them of, um, the tenets of their culture. He's, he's talking about how in, uh, the Book of Plenix demands uh, charity and forgiveness of debt in times of crisis. Hmm. Which we could certainly learn a thing or two from. Yeah. Uh, is there anything else I can grab from and deliver to the Citadel? Uh, Got to, gonna have to grab that, but that's gonna we're gonna have to go to Chachunka to get that. Mm. I have no idea where that is. I have no idea where that is. I, mean, I, I guess that is on Vermeer, actually. I have an idea where that is. Yeah, that would probably be on Vermeer. And in the Dranex system and DMZ. And that's supposed to not going to be till like later, if I remember correctly. Okay. Well, this I guess is on the percentile list. Yep. Let's see, Vermeer would be in my cluster, maybe. No, Sorry? probably not. I'll pro I'm probably wrong. Watch me be wrong. Well, you say you're wrong, so you might just be right. I am wrong. This is a Rachni cluster. <laughs> you think as much as I played this game, I remember where all the, sy where all the systems are? Nah. Mm, I didn't pass orient land orienteering. That's Ilos. I'm stupid. <laughs> but I know it's in the Terminus. I have no hmm. idea. You could just scan stuff. No, I don't think it's here. I don't think I think it was in a relay system. Hmm. I might just have to run a quick Google. Where the fuck is Vermeer? Maybe. No. No, that's Venture. That's Horizon. We are not going there right now. Does that mean we're going there later? It's a possibility. Okay, excuse me for a hot, hot second. Mass Effect. Vermeer. Where the fuck is Vermeer? No, I don't want... Uh, Milky Way oh, Century Omega yeah. Box System. Yep. Century <laughs> I was just there. Century Omega. There it is. So you were close at least. I told you I knew it was in the Terminus. I just didn't remember yeah. where in the Terminus. Listen, I can barely read a map. You want me to read a star chart? I don't know. What the hell are you doing, Alinko? I'm just making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what. Oh boy, what are you doing? Oh, you gotta remind me of this shit, bro. Alright, everybody, hang on! <sighs> One of these days, I'll play Mass Effect 3 playthrough with him instead of Ashley. 
I'm not gonna lie, I was kind of hoping you'd have picked him. Why did you quit have thought of me that? Incubation technology and... Artifact. See, the thing is, Ran, I was trying to, I was trying to make sure to make you make the, a lot of the hard choices. It's kind of the point. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. I ended up choosing the same thing, but oh well. Yeah, you ended up choosing the same thing I always pick. I guess sometimes we are too alike. <laughs> What's ironic is, uh, he's basically useless in the first game. But in this game, he really kicks it up a notch. Hmm. Because they've they've finally hit the balance on the effectiveness of biotic powers, and swapped him around from being a full vanguard from being a full biotic to a vanguard. Yeah, that will do it. All right. Oh. Let's just trade, shall we? We have options. Yep. The armor is not as important. I have the armor I already want. The only other armor mm. I'd want is that one, and I can just buy that. Yep. But gun. Indeed. Question is, what would we get? Uh, I'm not sure where you can get that. I know where you get that. I know where you get that. You can buy that. Uh, you can get all these elsewhere. Just about. Including the hit pulse rifle. <laughs> Pretty sure, actually. Hmm. Uh, except that. That is not something you're supposed to be able to get. Sounds like we should get it. Get heretic technology. Sure, we'll take that one. That was progress, I think. Got new toys. I hope the Grunt and Rex won't be too upset that we just found incubation technology and then traded it off. Shh, they don't need to know. So is that a, kind of an assault rifle? Probably. Oh, I don't it know. do! Oh my. Kind of slows me down a bit, you carrying it. Not surprising! But then again. <laughs> okay, that's it. Where's my sniper rifle? <laughs> <laughs> Jebber. I guess he would have been excited from that. Jebber. Somebody. Rex. I mean, I could really insult him. Just land headshot after headshot. Of course, if you really want to um, mess with Garrus. Automatic sniper rifle from the back of the range. Please note this is not good range safety. Mentally, that's quite a bit of recoil. Yeah, but still about four headshots. You hit. Yeah, I mean, yeah, you hit some of them. And most of those would have hit the shield anyway because of, uh, you know, barriers. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And if they have shields. Yeah, any, anything that's like right al that skirts the edge of a target would hit the shields. The best way to use the sniper rifle, though, would be not like that. <laughs> would be to start like right right at the chest and fire in little yeah. bursts. Yeah, uh, I can't see that working. Okay, uh, oh, right. I'm going to put... Take that off because it is not my kind of weapon. Oh. Now I'm gonna give it to someone else. 
Hydraulic decking. We're gonna give it to Legion once he shows up if we can. I mean, that's an option, yes. <laughs> like Garrus. Okay, that does it. Where's my sniper rifle? I like that the Spitfire is actually in the weapon rack. That's funny. That's nice. I have gun. Yes. Yes, you too. Gun. Yeah, next time we play XCOM, I'm definitely gonna put that one on a few of my soldiers. <laughs> Dear Commander Shepard, the Protheam beacon you encountered contained little data of use to the Crucible, but the items you recovered appear to be ancient and very powerful cybernetic implants. Dr. Tassoni is concerned about the risks of using such ancient techno technology, but my analysis of the stasis field shows that they remain perfectly intact. Accor accounting for your extensive cybernetics, <clears throat> well, uh, there we go. There is a low probability of rejection. Should you wish to integrate these devices, the medical team has been briefed and have prepared the medbay for cybernetic surgery. Have a pleasant day. Interesting. So let's go down and take a look. Yeah, that uh, certainly sounds useful. Probably. Maybe. Doctor, I'd like to hear the song. Trying to calculate amino acid decay rate. You said you would once the tests were done. <sighs> oh, better to die to a thrash a ball with shotgun blasting or recall than to play ambassadorial games with the blood of Shiaka in the veins. Off to fight some story in scant with diplomats instead of a grant, but you'll be soon to do Chanka's dream and live and die a Krogan queen. For she is the Krogan queen, hurrah, hurrah for the Krogan queen. It is a glorious thing to be the Krogan Queen. <laughs> Still prefer Patsy. <laughs> I really had to twist your arm. <laughs> I've never heard that one. Nice. Ah, so this is. He's so good. Uh, yeah. Okay. Is this also from a mob? Ah, yeah, interesting. Weapon heat dispersion plus 100%, which doubles clip capacity. But minus 20% health, 30% without, without avatar, and I don't have avatar. Yet. Mm. I'll have to consider that later. How do I have yeah. unlocked any bonus powers? No. I mean, I don't know, AP ammo. I thought I would have had uh, EDs by now. Hmm. Hers is a de uh, defensive matrix. Ah. Yeah, you will want that. And yeah, that's like another game plan. It looks like it would be great with the Get Spitfire. <laughs> Just keep shooting. Just keep shooting. Yeah, yeah, just shoot until it goes click. When does it go click? Never. <laughs> After the fight ends. Hello, Shepard. Nope, nothing from Edie. Edie, you're no help. <laughs> well, I guess we should bring her along more. Uh, it doesn't have much to do with it. Oh, well. Anyway, well, if nothing else, we can run by Dranak, grab some uh, Shadow Broker troops, and then stop by the Citadel again. Sounds cool. <coughs> or, wait, what's over here? Oh. There. Listen, I am mildly retarded. Uh, everyone is sometimes. Or, and here we are on this, we could save it for next time. Oh uh, yeah, it is over that time, isn't it? <laughs> well, oh, you'll have fun. Goodbye.